This is Western Mass News on ABC 40. Good Sunday evening, everyone. Thanks for joining us on Western Mass News at 6. I'm Matt Satilli. We begin this hour with a story that's grabbed the attention of the nation. Former U.S. President Jimmy Carter has chosen to enter hospice care. Today, we spoke with a local woman who worked in Washington during his presidency. Western Mass News reporter Olivia Hickey now joins us live in studio with more. Olivia. Matt, former state senator Linda McConian was an aide to former House Speaker Thomas P. O'Neill during Carter's presidency and worked with former President Carter's staff from the time he took office until he left in January 1981. She shares with Western Mass News that she was sad to find out that the 98-year-old would enter hospice care. First thing that came to my mind was all of the accomplishments that he made that are on display at his presidential library. And I wish him the best. And I hope, I'm sure he will go peacefully when his time comes. Former President Carter is well known as a champion of human rights and for his brokering of the Camp David Accords in 1978 between Egypt and Israel. He currently holds the title as the oldest living president in U.S. history. Coming up tonight on Western Mass News, we learn more about Malconian's experience working with Carter's staff. Reporting live in studio, Olivia Hickey for Western Mass News. Olivia.